Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the first video of our making Doc Ock CG Dorama in Quill. So I'm really excited about this because, um, you know, I'm, I'm testing a couple of things down the line and I'm really happy with the result that I'm getting. Uh, basically what we're going to do is we're going to make uh, this cool character, uh, Doc Ock. Uh, which I've always been fascinated about it uh, from the comics and, and of course in the movie so I'm gonna take a shot on this one uh, but it's not only gonna be a CG diorama we're also gonna make a 3D print of this so we're gonna make our own toys and that's something that is really what excites me more about this is that I am finding uh, a proper workflow to take my visions from Quill um, into a physical object into a physical uh, toy that I can print, but the first thing is to sketch our character, and that's how I'm doing in Quill. And basically using, you know, simple shapes, just modify them. In this case, I'm really trying to just focus on on the pose of the character, on having something that it will, you know, it will be dynamic, it will look cool, it will have a, a nice weight, uh, you know, a nice silhouette. So everything is like more on the trying to have something that then when it's gonna be printed it's gonna look cool on on my desk or it's gonna look cool and that's why i'm also taking this uh to sketchfab even if it's not fi final even if it's not uh, the finished version of quill and it's very far away from that i'm taking it to sketchfab because i really like to see how uh everything is, st is starting to take shapes put some lights put some environment some materials and i see uh very very fast how things are looking um so Stay tuned because there's a couple of more videos coming. Remember, uh, everything is going to be posted. Uh, the full workflow is going to be posted uh, next week on Saturday next week. Uh, so this is just a trailer. This is just, this is just a sneak peek of uh, how things are taking shape. So guys, have a great week and I'll talk to you later.